Hello, my name's Jasmine. I am getting my degree in photography. I'm actually graduating this year, so I'll be getting my BFA in photography. Um, I'm going to start off with my website here. So I'm not going to go through the entire thing. So I'm just going to go back and forth between my conceptual portrait, my conceptual and then my portraits. Um, I'm going to start with faceless. I want to say this is kind of where my photography began. I started exploring more with digital and with darkroom because for the most part I was always in the darkroom with a film camera. But then I kind of moved over to the digital, but I like being in the dark room. So I was trying to figure out how can I incorporate both of them together. So from there, I started going towards taking digital photos and then editing them and then printing in the dark room. All this whole series, I want to say one, like just one took me about two hours because instead of using a light table or like something to expose it. I went outside physically into the sun and sat and then god forbid it was cloudy. <laughs> but so those each were about two hours. So then leading from doing both I started doing digital strictly <laughs> doing digital strictly. So I wanted to evoke emotion out of my audience and I realized that's what I do a lot now with all my photography. I really like getting a reaction out of people. I, like, if you don't like it, why don't you like it? Tell me why you don't like it. What do you think I can do better? Because when it comes to photography, it's like, I think this is good, and I also think this is good. So it's kind of like, not really a fight, but more of a balance of who said this and who said that. So that's something I really look forward to when I do my photographs. Um, for film, um, the next one, actually not this one, but the next one that I did... This one was in the ASU Harrywood Gallery um, in 2019. So for this one, I really like when I do film and my whites are white and my blacks are black. So it gives like a really good contrast between the two. So moving over to my portraits, I still do black and white, but in digital now. But of course I still print with cyanotypes at the same time. I can't right now because I in my house I can't leave <laughs> um but I still do a regular what's it called traditional portraits of course because not everyone wants their face taken out of their portrait but I still go back and forth between what I like to do on the outside and then what I like to do when I'm with a client so there's just a few of those, but I just wanted to show that I do go back and forth with when it comes to art and when it comes to my photography. But other than that, I'm just going to scroll through this screen. But like I was saying, I really like when it comes to emotion with my photography. So I came up with a concept called faceless photography where I would take your portrait, but I take your face out of it. I haven't heard anyone else say that, so I'm trademarking it. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so, so, yep, photography is photography, and I like it. <laughs>